Okay, hi folks, this is video two, water pressure regulator system for jet boat. And um, this is what it looks like when it's installed. You have the pipe, which is a half inch MPT pipe thread that comes from your jet, goes to a gate valve, and then um, you have the pressure regulator um, system that we sell with the relief valve. Um, I did want to say that um, on a thermostat type um, system, some of these boats they use a thermostat in the engine rather than the gate valve so you wouldn't have the gate valve here and then in that case you would just take our regulator system and just bolt it directly to the half inch MPT thread and you would just take the screw off that we include with the kit so you don't have to use the gate valve <clears throat> um, again the way it works is the this is the jet pump this is the pipe that comes from the jet pump water flows through there all the way through and through our T-valve here to the actual engine. And then this is your spill when the pressure um, raises above 15 PSI or whatever you decide to actually adjust that spring to because by loosening it you can lower the pressure rating so that it dumps the, the spill sooner and they call it a spill because it's just releasing the water to the spill which is this hose. Now this hose runs back to the back of the boat I'm going to show you that right now. I'm just come back here with a video. <clears throat> just walk back here. You look in the back of the boat here. This is a spill, and that's where the water just runs out of the back of the boat and into the water. And that's all that does there. So that's a spill. Go back to the front. I'm going to show them. Um, so now I want to show you how the hose basically is routed. Um, for those of you that aren't real familiar with the hose routing on a jet boat. My, this particular boat has uh, header pipes, so what I do is I have the um, the water running from the jet runs to a hose which actually has a T, and that T will divide and split two hoses, and they go into the front of the water pump here. Um, you'll see there's one here, and there's one on the other side. Then the water runs through the motor, and it comes out the thermostat housing up here. Now one of the hoses is actually going to a spill, and the other one is teed off to a basset T-valve for the headers. And then the t uh, where it tees off, one goes to one header and one goes to the other. And here's one of the, um, the heater hoses that goes to the header. And the hose for the other thermostat housing that I was telling you, tees, it, uh, it, comes, it comes down and it runs to what's called a spill. And I have an actual regulator here. This regulates how much water is going to run out the back of the boat to a spill and how much water is actually going to run through the header pipes. That's the way that works. Um, now if you have um, water logs, then you won't have this gate valve and you won't have a spill. Basically all the water will run from my pressure regulator into your actual water logs and then out of your water logs to the front of your uh, water pump housings to the two different sides and that's basically the difference of that but that's our kit and that's how it works and uh, so if you have any questions you can email us at sales at boostbottleindustries.com or you can also reach us at sales at bbidesigns.com um,